you have a news tip, call us at 1-800-461-5820. Welcome back. Well, dogs are often called man's best friend, but, you know, in this case, they are mentors, too. I think so. People mm. with disabilities are finding new ways to live their lives with the help of some four-legged friends, thanks to a program that's taking off. Casey Colby shows us how these special relationships are giving some young people a real sense of empowerment. They roll and play, and when their mother, Aurora, takes time for a drink, so do they. But as cute as they are, these Labrador Retriever puppies have a very important job. These are five-week-old puppies who will become service dogs, and they'll support people with mobility disabilities, people in wheelchairs or who have difficulty walking. They'll learn how to turn on lights for people who can't and assist with everyday tasks like retrieving a wallet and they'll be trained by Nantire Shores secondary students like Andrea Okapiknik who says this program is the best part of school. I think it's amazing. I was new to Nantire last year and I've never seen anything like this before. It's all part of a high school assistance program that's taught by Jane Boak, the founder of COPE, which stands for Canine Opportunity People Empowerment. She says the dogs just don't learn from the students, they teach the students. The strides that these kids make in training the dogs is just incredible. It's mind-blowing and I, I love watching it every day. Students bond with the dogs in their own classroom, complete with coat hooks for the dogs. And the students take the dogs to other schools to help with reading and math programs. Carly says after working with her dog McFlurry for a whole year, it will be tough to say goodbye. But I know she's going to be good when she's with her life partner, so it's going to be a good thing to see her go. And Caitlin Krause says Malibu has helped her decide what she wants to do for a living. I didn't really know what I wanted to do before, and now that I've worked with Malibu, I want to be a vet. As invaluable as the services that dogs like Beacon provide, they come with a price. To professionally train each one of these COPE dogs costs about $22,000. How you can become involved with the dogs and enjoy the puppy cam, go to copedogs.org. Casey Colby, A News. What a great story, and I'm telling you, if you could just hear all the awes that were going on in this studio while that was on, beautiful story. Well, in sports.